y'all. It's been far too long, honey. I know y'all said, Diva, we sick of you coming up on this channel every two months. So we're we going to get it together. Now that I'm shopping more, uh, if you're not seeing my vlogs over on my Diva Wine channel, which is the channel that I am on daily, I'm now getting more and more products, which are including skincare. So, dun, dun, dun. I told y'all we was going to... Actually, I didn't because this one caught me by surprise. Um, now that I am, you know, got some money flowing, I'm getting my body and stuff right. You know, we still got this handsome hair to deal with. But neither here nor there, I said, well, let me get this skincare right as I'm getting my health together. I get these jobs going and all of this. I'm upgrading my fashions, upgrading my hair, which y'all are soon going to see. I was like... We need to update some darn on hair care products. I'm running low on my body butter. I'm about to run out of sugar scrub. Like, what am I going to darn going to get? Now, of course, I'm going to re-up with some of those companies, but I wanted to try something new. So, I came across this on my Instagram. It's called, ooh, I'm going to mess up their name, Nagoza Organics. So, we're going to go ahead and open up the box. Now, for y'all that's on my Diva Wine channel, y'all know I just did a Timu haul. Now, that um, haul did not include any skincare, but next um, next haul, which I will be doing in a couple days. Well, no, I will be ordering in a couple days, and then y'all will see it in a couple weeks. Unless they are going to spread shipping really is that fast. Um, it took me a little over two weeks. About borderline pushing three weeks to get my products with regular shipping. I think with a spread shipping, it, it cuts it probably in half. But anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and unbox this. I seen a whole bunch of darn on skincare products and stuff, though. I do want to try out on there, though. So I will be getting that in addition to some more wigs and, you know, more clothes and all that. So y'all going to see the outdated clothes finally check. Now, this one I'm going to keep because this, this never gets old. It's like I can just throw this on. It don't wrinkle or anything. But shout out to Nasal. Ne Hold on. Let me get this thing so I can know how I'm pronouncing this. Nagazi Organics. Nagoz. Or is it. Yeah. Nagazi Organics. Honey. <laughs> if the owners of this company come across this. I'm Southern. But please give me the phonetic pronunciation of this. But this is their business. This is their card. Y'all tell me how to pronounce that. N-G-O-Z-I-O-R. Well, you know, organics or whatnot. It's like, how the heck do I pronounce that? But yeah, I got four products with them. Uh, how much did I end up spending? I spent the cute coin. But it wasn't that much of a coin. Maybe they gave me a receipt somewhere in here. Da, da, da. Oh, they didn't give me the receipt up in here. I guess they said, oh, we sent you a receipt to your email. But I want to say it came down to like 50 some dollars when it was all said and done. Individually, this would have ran me over 70 some dollars, but I had a discount. Honey, y'all know Diva stay with an old nasty piece of discount code, honey. And matter of fact, I'm going to give y'all a discount code to use at the end of this video as well um, for you to get some Dargon discounts on it. Um, if you want one of the bundles, um, you can get 20% off. And let's start off with it. So this is the Nagazi Organics Brightening Body Wash. This is lemon, papaya, and cultic acid. It is 8 fluent ounces. It has a 12-month shelf life from the date that it's opening. Uh, open. It says pump three drops on wash cloth. Oh, on washcloth, sponge, and rub on skin to lather. Maintain lather for a minimum of three minutes. Wash off. Okay, I was about to say, clothes. Wait a minute now. <laughs> we ain't, This ain't no darn on Bronner's Brothers. We ain't trying to darn on, uh, you know, use this as a multifaceted. But ingredients are short, simple, sweet, to the point. Cocoa, glucoside, polysorbate, 80, lemon powder, papaya, Kojic acid and cocoa betaine. So pretty much the lemon powder is going to be your brightener. Kojic acid, your th you know, your thyrosine inhibitor. 
and all of that good stuff. And the reason why it's saying leave on for three minutes is because obviously it's going to take the time for those products to activate. So you want to rub it on in and let the products work. Matter of fact, we want to try this tonight. We definitely going to try this tonight. After I get off of here, I'm going to um, exercise for a half hour. And then I'm going to jump in the shower. Let's see, do it got any smell to it? Oh, it smells just like lemon and papaya. Y'all, this smell like something that you can drink. Now, of course, I've heard of a lot of products that say have a lemon smell, and they be having that bull crap. Uh, it it either be like a pine saw smell. Or it would be more like a, 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 a cake-like smell. Now, Suja's actually makes a lemon pound cake, which I'm interested in. Um, but, honey, d one had to choose her coins wisely. I was like, well, we can't afford the splurge on Suja's yes yet. Now, if anybody wants to get me some Suja's um, um, lemon pound cake, honey, I definitely would love to try that. But at 30 some dollars a pop, I was like, yeah, we ain't, we ain't going to try it just now. I think this cost me $18.95, but oh, my God. This literally smells like a lemon and papaya drink. Darn, I can't wait to darn go wash with this tonight. Oh my goodness. And of course, if I'm wrong on the prices, I will annotate the prices in the description box below. So the next thing we got is the Healing Balm Neem Moringa Tea Tree. So I'll give y'all a little description on this. Perfect herbal healing balm for eczema. Ding, 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 ding. Um, strawberry legs. So I've had a couple of y'all on here say, well, Diva, what do you use for strawberry legs? If you want a product, here you go. Well, we're going to see, though. And body acne. Um, so, you know, of course, with me, I have um, not only eczema, but I do have some keratosis pilaris, which gives me these little bumps in certain areas. Such as, you know, my shoulders, the glutes area. So, let's see how it works with the keratosis pilaris. It says apply on skin twice a day. Has a 12-month shelf life uh, from the date that it's open. A blend of shea butter, beeswax, mango butter, sunflower oil, neem powder, moringa powder, matcha powder, tea tree, and essential oils. Come on through. You getting a whole good old eight ounces, honey, which I'm betting is concentrated. Oh, okay. It don't really have a... It has a soft smell. Matter of fact, guys, um, to my gays that don't want no fruit, because this one's going to give you all the darn one lemon and uh, papaya and all that now for the ones who are guys who like more of a cologne scent now i'm a girl that don't mind a, uh an androgynous scent this is what it's going to give so oh yeah yo uh to my women if you want a skincare product for your husband that is actually going to darn gonna help their skin but they don't want to smell like flowers and all the floral stuff this is the perfect product because when I tell you it has a, like a soft cologne-like smell, we just taking that much and seeing how much it goes. We're going to put it on the back of my hand. Like so. Oh, yeah, you can tell that it, it is very emollient. Yeah, this is going to go a long way. Oh, yes, look at that. Oh, okay, now it really activates. Second thought, ooh. When you rub it onto the skin, it gets more potent. Which is weird because when you smell it, it's very faint. But when you put it on the skin, it definitely has a potent smell. Uh, it's starting to shift to a grandma, grandish smell. No, it's still got a little cologne and a, a tone to it. Okay, so it's giving very unisexual ish. Like, in certain aspects, it's giving, you know, grandma, auntie ish. But in other aspects, it's giving like a 40 some year old mature man with a little bit of cologne. 
Like it's giving me a crawl. Is you? What the? This is rather unique, honey. It's hard to explain this scent, but it's like a cross between a cologne and a perfume. Like it's the perfect and drying in this scent. Like your man will have a little hint of a, like yeah, your man will have a little hint of a, a of a feminine floral flair, but it's still enough for him to wear. And for you, it would be a very toned down, you know, almost cologne type of scent on a woman. But it still have those notes. So I guess it really depends on the body chemistry and how you pair this. But yeah, y'all. Oh my goodness. Honey, they got me alone off the smell. You had me at the smell. The smell. Honey, the smells are gorgeous. So, then we got the body cream dark spot eraser. This is four ounces um, for dark spots and marks using our best selling cream. First time user, do a patch test. Um, so, it contains shea butter, mango butter, distilled water, emulsifying wrap, cereal alcohol, lemon extract, liquor rice, camu camu extract, papain, uh, kojic acid, and optophen. I'm not even sure what that is. I guess that's the one where we need the patch test for because I'm looking at everything else and I'm not seeing where the patch test would come in handy. Because it, it wouldn't be for the liquor rice asterisk. That's your brightener and thyrosine inhibitor. Your lemon asterisk, well, might be irritating to some folks, but most people already know if they have a sensitivity to citrus. Uh, same thing for papayan asterisk. Now, the coach acid is your exfoliator. So, and that's, you know, what's helping to fade the dark spots. Uh, for me, my dark spot areas are going to be, because I'm a thicker girl downstairs, um, you know, for people who see my body, y'all know I, I flare out like this. And the thing is, I have the thigh issue where the thighs rub together at times and I am prone to getting the darkness in between the thighs. Also, because I got a little bit of a backside, I also tend to get the hyperpigmentation on the awkward area where the thigh meat meets the, you know, the gluteus maximus. So I need it for those areas. Also, I got some spots on my legs. Um, since I've been slacking on my, you know, hair treatment, I also do get some sporadic dots from time to time when I shave. So we're going to use that for this. Let's see what this is giving as far as the smell is concerned. Ooh, it's whipped, honey. You know what? Each one of these products got some, a different type of smell to it. Now, this is funny that this got a totally different smell than this, considering that you can actually purchase this as a, a brand. Like, you can get the glow serum and all of that together. They sell a whole lightning package for like 70 some dollars. Now, me, since my discoloration is very minimal, I'm not dealing with, like, full-blown, you know, hyperpigmentation like I used to years in the past. So, I, I didn't feel the need to get the whole kit. But for people who do, they do um, have the whole lightning kit, which I will give a discount code um, down below. Okay, yeah, the smells do darn on. They do darn on overlap each other. Hmm. Okay. I'm making sure to use different fingers. Make sure I'm not darn going double dipping products. We're going to use it in this area. Okay, y'all see it goes on smooth. Y'all see how whip it is? Hey, look at that. And a little bit goes a long way. Y'all see that little nail part right here? We're going to put it on our bare face. And we're going to see how that goes. Now, once again, y'all just seen that was a nail size. Oh, let me get back. Oh, yes. A little bit goes a long way, y'all. This is definitely...
Now, I don't even know if this was really meant for the... Oh, yeah, this is the body cream. Technically, y'all, y'all don't put this on y'all face. The next product is actually what you're supposed to put on your face. But see, me, I've been dealing with dry skin with this darn on transitioning. So, I could use a little bit of uh, heavier stuff. Or whatnots, but yeah, you really focus that on your darkened areas. Now, for me, I just wanted to show y'all how much um it stretches out. So for me, oh, this is gonna last me a good minute, honey. Because it's like y'all seen how much that darn on little bit just covered my entire face, right? So it's like, yeah, <laughs> I don't need it for like I said, I don't really have no discoloration areas. Maybe I can also use it for like my underarms and stuff as well. Oh, wait a minute. Why is it taking a minute to turn back? If I can turn... Uh-oh. Okay, now I might have to deduct the point on it not catching. Okay, there it go. Okay, so y'all notate that it does. You do have to press down a little bit on this. Okay, there we go. I like how they got the gold little uh, top. That, honey, they they got my favorite color scheme going on. Honey, they doing the damn thing. And last but not least is we got the Nagazi Organics Glow Repair Butter made with shea butter, jojoba oil, enriched with vitamin E and kakudu, kakudu plum. So, it says healing facial butter that could help clear breakouts, brighten any dark spots and hyperpigmentation, packed with powerful ingredients to restore your skin. First time use, do a patch test, refer to our skincare site for more information. And then, of course, uh, shea butter, mango butter, kakua, plum, extract, vitamin E, jojoba oil, aloe vera gel, and lemon essential oil. Okay. And, of course, all of these pretty much are 12 months from the date that you open them. You open this up like this, you're going to get... Hmm, let me see. Now, this is darn going 4 ounces, and this looks like it's the same. So, we're going to say 4 ounces as well. I don't see the ounces on here, but, yeah, we're going to say 4 ounces. Because this is 8 ounces, I believe. Yeah, because I made sure to get this. Now, they do offer this in a smaller size. As well as they offer these in larger size. But like I said, my discoloration is very minimal. So I don't need no big old thing. But if you're somebody that does need a bigger tube. If you're dealing with like psoriasis, severe hyperpigmentation, eczema. Where you got the dark patches. This is going to be your best friend in addition to this. Now for the face, it looks like this is where it's at. So, same whip consistency as the the butter, as the dark spot eraser. So, I'm going to actually open this again for comparison sake. So, same. As you can tell, this is the dark spot side. It got more of that yellow tinge to it versus the strawberries, more pure white in color. Turn the lights on. My guilty pleasure, I ain't going nowhere. Long as you're here, I'll be floating on there. Sweet trees. Honey, this is like a sweet dream, honey. But there we go. Oh, this don't really have a, a smell, at least not within the um in the thing. But let's test it out. I'm running out of spots to test it on, y'all. I haven't used this arm, so we'll use this arm for a test. Even though this is supposed to go on the face, but I just used the last product for the face. So, let's see how much that stretches out. Okay, this don't really got no smell. Ooh, come on through, honey. Yes. Now, granted, this is supposed to be for the face, but, honey, it's doing the body good, honey. Ooh, I might use it. Now, why am I wanting to use it for the other arm as if I'm not about to darn on exercise and jump my behind in the shower afterwards? Look at that. Look how much it goes a long way. Oh, my goodness. So, you can realistically double this up and use it on the body if need be. 
and actually I would recommend this for people who have more of the sensitivity to like the centrists or whatnot. Um, this could pretty much anything that you can use on your face, you can really use on your body. Now you just got to be careful on what products, like body products can be possibly comedogenic to the face, but anything that's formulated for the face can definitely be used to the body. It just might not cover as much because your face, you know, products formulated for the face is sometimes meant to be a little bit lighter than what is meant to be on the body. The body, you put on heavier stuff, you know, your heavier emollients and stuff like that. But yeah, this definitely don't have no scent to it at all. So for the girls who want something scent free, now it's saying essential oil, lemon essential oil. I don't smell a nail bit of lemon in this. This smell very plain. Like the other ingredients in here is canceling out whatever lemon scent that it is. Especially when you compare it to like this right here. When you compare it to this, this this makes up for that, that non-smelling right here. This is giving you like a lemon darn on a cocktail drink. This is giving you the lemon cocktail drink. The dark spot cream. Is giving you the more subtle version of that. And then for the guys or for my women who don't mind an androgynous scent, you got this darn one body butter right here. Shoot, I'm running out of body spots. The darn gonna test this on y'all. Ooh, my stomach is hairy, so we ain't gonna use my butter, but let's darn gonna unbutton this and use my decollete instead. I'm running out of body parts to use, y'all. So we'll just use my decollete area to demonstrate this one more time. And we're going to be on up out of here. So once again, oh, <laughs> wrong finger to use, y'all. But that much of a mouth. So the tip of my nail, oh, Lord, y'all almost flicked y'all off. My bad, y'all. Oh, my goodness. So let's just see how much that goes right there. Ooh, come on through, honey. So as y'all can tell, ooh, and it gives the skin just a nice darn going glow. Oh my God, come on through, darn going clavicle bone popping. Y'all see how I got my skin just as glowing, honey? Like I said, I can't wait to really darn going to use this all over my body and give y'all a, a further demonstration. Ooh, matter of fact, we just, we want to do something right here real quick for the gram, honey. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Maybe, let me make sure my body ain't showing first, honey. Okay, y'all know we have to take our pics, honey. Pose for the camera now. Click, click, click. Pose for the camera now. Click. But yeah, y'all, honey, first impressions, I am loving it. The shipping was extremely fast. Um, within the first day, they gave me discount codes on top of discount codes to use to the point where I'm sharing with y'all. And these are not promo codes as far as, you know, my own code. These are just codes they gave me for general discounts. So if you're interested in... You know, the entire line of this that contains the culture acid. Like I said, I would, I would recommend that for people who suffer from more like full body hyperpigmentations and all of that. Um, if you have more so just spot treatment areas, you can just go with one or two products. And note that it's still going to, you know, it's going to last you a good minute, honey. Y'all seen how much a dime size amount covered my entire face. So don't think if you a plus size girl with well, Diva, I ain't snatched like you. I got a few rolls, honey. Y'all seen how this product goes, honey. It, I don't care how big you are. You can be Lizzo big, honey. It's going to darn going to cover you and this is going to darn going to last you a good minute. Now, if you Lizzo and you got full body hyperpigmentation, Okay, we're going to keep it real. You might want to upgrade to the 8 ounces. That's why they got different size options for the girls who need it, honey. They got you covered, honey. I'll leave the site down below. But like I said, honey, first impressions. I'm loving it. Honey, I'm smelling like all types of androgynous cologne and 
lemon berry and everything else. My face is, oh, this is going to be my nighttime. Matter of fact, that is what I needed for the longest. I was out of a, like a, a decent sized nighttime cream or whatnot. I got every type of other serum and potion and lotion. Uh, there is, I got my retinol. Uh, matter of fact, this will be excellent after my retinol treatment. Y'all know I'm a girl in my 30s now, so um, I definitely need to start incorporating more retinol because as, you know, as we get older, the collagen, you know, produces less and less when we're in our 30s. We start to notice crow's feet in the eyes and stuff like that. You know, you, you get more of the lines and stuff. So, you know, incorporating retinols and then following up with something like this. And then it's non-comedogenic or whatnot, so you don't have to worry about it clogging up the pores, which is good for people who have oily skin. Because I know y'all going to say, well, Diva, you no longer got oily skin no more. Your skin is dry. And I see it shining, 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 yay. All this winning, ay. All this winning, ay. Would this darn going to work for um, oily skin? I would say yes because of the way that it's balanced. Shea butter, you got to be real careful with. Shea butter can be a little bit heavy if it's not formulated right. Uh, shea butter that is like thick and whatnot, it can darn going to clog up real quick. But the way they got this whip so darn on good, the way they got this rip, you ain't going to have to worry about that. Y'all see how it just, just absorbed right into the skin. Versus other bombs and stuff that I've had, it sits on the skin and it creates more like a coating. Like a film or whatnot, this just absorbed right into the skin. So you don't have to worry about that for oily skin. Um, also, with oily skin, sometimes it's good to introduce some oils into your skin to help balance out your skin production. And I know that sounds counterproductive, but hear me out. With oily skin, if you introduce ingredients like jojoba oil, it actually levels out your natural sebum production. So it tells your brain to produce less oil naturally. So you would just have enough oil on your skin to keep your skin hydrated without, you know, causing acute breakouts, this, that, and the third. Um, And what else is in here? Your aloe vera gel is going to serve as your moisturizer. Your lemon essential oil is going to be used to help any, you know, post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation marks. Then your mango butter and your shea butter is going to be more so your moisturizing ingredients. And it doubles up, I, I want to say, as an emollient as well. So, honey, this is definitely Diva Wine approved. Esthetician darn going to prove thus far based off of my initial first impressions. Like I said, honey, we're going to start experiment with this the darn on night. Matter of fact, let me put this on over here on the side. I'm going to go ahead and use that. And I think I'm going to use this healing balm because I do got a, a flare up on my foot. Because even with me, nobody's perfect, babe, babe. That's why I'm going to the allergist. So, yeah, I got a flare up on my foot. A eczema flare patch. So, we definitely going to test this all the way out and see how it works on active eczema flares. And then, let me see, Dark Spot Eraser is going to be for the back door. So, obviously, y'all ain't going to see that. Um, it's going to be for the thighs and, you know, some spot treatments on the what the ta 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 So, we're going to put that aside as well. And, hell, I guess my face is already darn going moisturized enough for the night. But we're going to put this up. For my darn on face. So that is it y'all. Uh, feel free to like, comment, share, subscribe. The site will be down below. They do have other products. But these are the products I felt comfortable for my skin. Or what not for me to demonstrate for y'all. Um, if you did not see anything. Um, that of uh, That is of your liking. Definitely still check out the site. Because they still got other stuff. Um, they got stuff for people who have very oily skin. Like I said they got a whole lightning line. Um, and a whole host of other products. But, you know, once again, Diva Wine is on a budget still. And Diva Wine don't necessarily need all the products. Because y'all know I, I got tons of professional skincare products, equipment, and stuff to go through. Matter of fact, I'm giving away skincare products to my clients. I mean, not my clients. Soon to be clients, but my co-workers. Because I got products that I need to get rid of. So, obviously, I want to go light on products that I'm introducing until... I get some of these other products out. But yeah, that is it, y'all. 
feel free to like, comment, share, subscribe, check out the site to see everything they have to offer. Um, every product that has been shown will be featured down below along with the current prices and um, discount codes as well. So like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I will see y'all soon with more videos. Mwah.